Hi there, my name is Catherine and I am an online business English teacher. I used to post on YouTube quite a lot, but I had to stop because I started working in a school. However, I now have some more free time and I'm looking forward to posting more content online again. Hopefully it's helpful. If it is, give it a thumbs up. If it's not, let me know in the comments and I will see what I can do for future videos. So as an English teacher, I have noticed a lot of my students from all over the world, all different countries, pronouncing these words incorrectly. They really struggle with the pronunciation. And it's completely understandable because it's one of the only words in the English language that has an X in the middle of the word, except medical terminology. In everyday usage, this is one of the only words that has an X in the middle of it. So when you see the word spelled like this, the X becomes a Z sound, Z, Z, Z sound. Anxiety, anxiety. You'll notice there's a little G sound as well, just before the Z. So anxiety, anxiety. Some examples of how you can use this in a sentence are, I have anxiety. I struggle with anxiety. I take medication for my anxiety. This is causing my anxiety levels to rise. However, when you see the word spelled like this, of course the pronunciation changes because English is never that simple. There's always one exception to the rule. Like this, the X, the X becomes a T-C-H sound. Like the N sound in catch, catch a ball, to catch a ball. Catch, ch, ch. So we use that sound and we say anxious, anxious. Try it a few times. If you can't quite get it, try saying catch, 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 and then use that N sound, ch, 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 anxious. There's also a small G sound just before, anxious, but is not as strong as in anxiety. Anxious, anxious. Some example sentences could be, my boss scheduled a meeting on Monday and it's making me anxious. I am anxious about the upcoming results of my exam. Or my friend is very anxious. So what is the difference between anxiety and anxious? Well, good question. Anxious is an adjective. We use it to describe how we feel. I am feeling anxious. My friend feels anxious. This thing is making me feel anxious. However, anxiety is a noun. It is the name of our body's response to stress or worry. Anxiety is something that people suffer with. They may take medication for their anxiety. They may see a doctor about their anxiety. Think of it like this. This thing here is making me anxious. However, my anxiety, the anxiety belonging to me, is being affected because of this. The focus is more on my anxiety. Whereas with anxious, the focus is on the thing that's causing you to feel anxious. So if you're watching this video, you probably already know the meaning of these words, but just in case you don't, it's another way of saying worried or stressed. But why not just say worried or stressed? Well, think of it like a sliding scale like this. Worry is down here and anxiety is right at the top here. So we worry about really minimal things. I am worried about my exam results. I am worried I will drop my phone. I am worried because my friend has not texted me. However, anxious is a much stronger feeling. So for example, I am anxious about my future. I am anxious about my court date. I am anxious because I didn't get the promotion I was expecting. You can also think of it this way if this helps. Everyone worries. Everyone has stress. That's normal. We have that in our everyday lives. But only some people are anxious. Only some people suffer with anxiety. We can, of course, all have anxious moments in our lives. But worry and stress passes. Whereas anxiousness and anxiety stays with you. It's something that you live with and you learn to live with and a lot of people take medication or see a doctor or go to a therapist for their anxiety and anxiousness. So I hope you learned something from this video and most importantly learned the pronunciation of these two difficult words, anxiety and anxious. If you did, make sure you like the video. 
Uh, I'm hoping to put out content a lot more regularly and I really hope that you enjoyed it. Okay, thank you. Have a fantastic week. Bye.